Hi guys, Kurt Provost here, your guide to all things new skin. Today, I'm doing an episode that has been much requested by you guys, and that is, what on earth do we do with the décolletage? Now, that's an area that uh, you may or may not be familiar with because it's using a fancy French word that I'm no doubt going to be butchering for the rest of this episode. So let's deal with that first. The décolletage is from the cleavage up to the neck. It's a rather large area encompassing the beginning of the shoulders, the collarbone, uh, the breasts, and of course, up to the beginning of the neck there. It came from the word or originates from the word décolleter, which is to cut away at the neckline and to reveal the breasts a bit more. So as far as a guy is concerned, I think it's a fantastic innovation that came about in the 19th century and let's hope it sticks around. There's also the adjective of decolete, which is uh, what a lot of people use. So you may be familiar with those different words. So décolletage gets a lot of attention, at least a lot of attention from the environment. It almost as much as the face in the summer months and that's because it's warm, we want to show as much skin as possible, fantastic. However, while a lot of people are paying attention to the face and making sure that they're looking after the skin of their face, they're kind of neglecting the décolletage. So what are some things that you can do to number one, prevent damage to this area and number two, treat damage if you have any, um, for that area. So I'm going to break it up into two different sections. The first one is prevention. Let's deal with that because that is key. If you can get put in place today, some very small, simple steps that can become a habit and a routine for you that you'll continue for the rest of your life, then you're going to have fantastic results. And it's of course, much easier to deal with anything as it comes up. So it's, very much like the treatment you would give your face because the skin on the décolletage tends to be a bit thinner than the rest of the body and so there's there's a lot of um, things that could go wrong here because when you've got thinner skin that means signs of aging are going to show up sooner. So the first step is what are you going to do with the face? Well, the first step is always to clean the face and gently exfoliating this area will have great results. And as you're exfoliating your face, if you have a gentle exfoliator, that would be great for on the chest area. I believe the brighter day exfoliating scrub is great for this chest area. Uh, some people have asked me, can you use the Lumispa? You can. Uh, particularly if you've got dry skin, I'd be using the dry cleanser with it. It's just, it's a very large area. So you're going to go through a lot of cleanser and it will take quite a while, but it's totally possible to use the Lumi Spa on the décolletage area. So that kind of gets that foundation of exfoliating, making sure the dead skin cells are removed, any impurities, any oil that's clogging up the pores, it's all out of there then the next step is going to be with vitamin C face wash. Now you can use this if you're in a hurry, you, you're not exfoliating so much, you can use that on the chest uh, in place of it because the vitamin C is quite potent and I find that it has a fantastic kind of exfoliating effect on more of a chemical level, I guess you could say, than a physical level. So what you can do is you can leave it on there like a little mask for your chest for a couple of minutes or if you're in a hurry just rub it over and then wash it off with some water that is fantastic for any pigmentation damage it works both in the treatment column and in the prevention column so it'll brighten the skin and help uh, stimulate the collagen production all these different things that you really want to have happening on this part of your body well on all of your body i guess so the next step is then to use a toner uh, a lot of people wouldn't do this because they're not treating it like their face, but just basically what you're using on the face, use on your décolletage. Just extend it out a little bit further and your body will love you for it. And then you're going to uh, provide a daily moisturization. There's a number of different products from New Skin that you could do this with. Uh, the first one I will say is the Epoch Baobab Body Butter. This one is incredibly rich and hydrating, has a lovely smell. So depending on what you're looking for, what your budget is, this is probably uh, the most universal one, I would say. The second one is 
the dermatic effects. As you can see behind me right here, it is currently being used the most. It is designed for this area. It is a very intense uh, hydrating cream for the body. It's fantastic for cellulite on your legs, but it's also fantastic for the decolletage. So you can check out this video here that goes into it in much more detail. And then there is the True Face Essence Duet. This one is from the True Face line, as the name gives away, the same as the True Face Essence Ultra, the serum for the face. It's specifically designed with a mixture of the uplifting cream and the serum that is for the neck and the decolletage area. So this is kind of the premium end of care, but if anti-aging is your focus, then this is the one that you're gonna be using every single day and you'll love the results. So that's the daily skincare routine that you'd be using. It might sound like a lot, but it, it's not really. It's the same as what you're gonna be doing for your face, just extending it down. There are also some extra activities that your, your lifestyle will impact the way your decolletage is going to look with time. If you are a side sleeper, if you roll over and sleep like this, well, I'm sorry to break it to you, but that's gonna to tend to create these lines down the center that will lead to your cleavage. Uh, generally, the, the larger the breasts, also the, the more gravity has to pull there and the more of an impact that you'll notice on your decolletage. So if you can, I highly recommend beginning to sleep on your back. I know that's a difficult transition, but uh, with time, I have faith in you, you will succeed. It's just a healthier way for your body to be resting at nighttime, less uh, environmental pushing and pulling on your body, which we really do not want. The other thing is exercise. Of course, exercise is fantastic for the body. It's fantastic for anti-aging. Not talking about exercising to the extreme but just being constantly active and using the wonderful gifts that have been given to us every single day if you can do that that's going to have wonderful effects for this area and every other area of your body now there is one more activity that i'll put in the prevention column and that is to uh, release the pressure of tension stress of the decolletage area so what you can do is you can start at the sternum here and with your knuckles uh, if you're just moisturized, then that's gonna be the perfect time to do this because there'll be a bit more, uh, a bit slicker so you can move your knuckles, but just gently work your way out to your shoulder. Do that a few times. And if you do that every day, do it on the other side obviously as well. That's gonna help with the circulation, that's going to help with the release of tension. And over time, that's really going to help your decolletage area particularly when you're combining it with the skincare. All right, so let's get into the treatment. All right, it's basically like the prevention model. However, there will be a few tweaks of devices and specific treatments. I'd be using the vitamin C face wash uh, for much longer. You could use the Lumispa to exfoliate. That's gonna provide a better exfoliation. However, body loofra or the exfoliating scrub will work as well. Then you got vitamin C face wash. Then I would be using either the boost, the age lock boost, because that's fantastic for dealing with pigmentation. So if pigmentation is more of an issue on there and you wanna brighten it up, you wanna improve the skin tone, then I would be working with age lock boost on the decolletage. Or you can go for the heavy hitters, which is of course the galvanic face bar with the body attachment. Now, unfortunately, I don't have the face bar on the shelf behind me today. It's currently in use, but it's the little attachment and I'll link to here where you can just go and check out how to use that. It's brilliant for the body. You're using it with the body shaping gel, which is the blue tube that you see down the corner there with the body spa. You could also use the body spa. Uh, that would be much quicker because it's a much larger surface. That will particularly come in handy if you're a bit heavier set. If you have, uh, you're more endowed with larger assets in this area, then you, <laughs> that's my way of trying to be very um, politically correct. <laughs> as, as a heterosexual guy talking about breasts, it's a difficult topic to navigate. But nonetheless, uh, if, if you are uh, a bit larger in this area than using the galvanic uh, body spa or the face spa with the body attachment is going to be more effective. It may not be as necessary if, if that's not the case for you. Uh, so it's gonna be different things 
for different bodies, of course. We are all slightly different. That's why I've given you a broad example here. All right, guys, that's the episode. I hope it helps you to have a phenomenal décolletage now and in the future. If you have any questions about what you've seen in this video, if you want to get your hands on the products in this video, you can do so through the links below or just send me a email. My contact details are at the end. I look forward to hearing from you. And if you're watching this going, you know what? I think I'd love to build a business with those products because they sound amazing. And you know what? I've got a bunch of people who want help with their décolletage. And I think I could be the supplier for them rather than just the consumer. How do I go about that, Kurt? Well, I'm so glad you asked because I'm actively expanding and building my business around the world and I'd love to hear from you. My details are at the end and we can go through everything from there. Or you can just find me on social media at Kurt Provost on Instagram and Facebook. That's it for today, guys.